we'll look at how to import materials from ANSYS to SimCenter 3D. We'll begin by importing the ANSYS input file, making sure we've got the dimensionality of that input file correct. And this input file has all of the materials that we'd like to create a library of in SimCenter 3D. So here we get a log file of the cards that were imported from ANSYS. Next we'll go to the FEM where we'll go to manage library materials and here you can see the local materials that were imported. It's a good idea to take a look at all of the material properties that were imported. It's easy to see that by adding those properties that we want to take a look at as additional columns. So here we've got mass density, Young's modulus, and Poisson's ratio, and the dimensionality looks correct on those as a double check. Next we'll select all of the materials and export them to the library. Here we can give it a location and a name for the library. And we're done. Next to reuse those material properties, let's go ahead and open up a new part file and we can use that library to assign materials to the bodies. So here we'll go ahead and select one of the bodies and then we'll use that material library that we just created to assign a material from it to one of the objects. So here we'll select material ID 1. And that's how we can import materials from ANSYS and assign them to objects in SimCenter 3D.